Alright you guys, welcome back to another vlog. What is going on? I hope you're all well. Today's video, I'm just going to have a quick chat about what happened a couple of days ago. So, as the title suggests, I played my first game of rugby in three years. Yesterday, or two days ago. But it wasn't contact, it was actually touch rugby. So, sorry about the clickbait title guys, but uh, it was touch. Anyways, it doesn't matter whether it was contact or touch it seems, because lo and behold, I got injured. I got fucking injured. All right, first game back in three years, I got injured. But luckily, luckily it wasn't too bad. So what happened, excuse the underwear, was basically a hyperextension of my knee. Um, I've had that once before, probably about four years ago. My only other really major injury with rugby has been my rotator cuff. Um, probably about seven years ago now, I went to go, I was kicking the ball through, running against another fella um, who was defending, I was attacking, running for the ball that was over the try line, we both dived for it, I dived like this, landed like that, I touched the ball, but what happened is my whole body fucking hit the ground and uh, basically my shoulder got hyperextended that way, up. So I, I hit the ground on my stomach and my shoulder went like that. So I don't know exactly what happened. I never got it fully treated or checked, but I know it was a rotator cuff injury and I couldn't, I couldn't raise my shoulder over my head for about six weeks after that. So that was back in 2010. Last time I injured myself was 2014. I fucked my knee, a bit of a hyperextension exactly like what's happened here. But um, I'll tell you, tell you what happened. I was running along. So what happened was I was running this way. I wanted to step off my right foot and run that way. I was running this way, I went like this, but what's happened is this foot has somehow been caught up and and hit the ground and my knee has, has, has gone backwards, which means that from the side it looks like this. So if my knee locks out, it's basically it's locked out and it's gone backwards slightly and then come back in. So it's hyperextended that way. And uh, at the moment, if I do lock my knee out like that, I can really, really feel it in the side here. So I'm not exactly sure what I've done or what ligament or what freaking tendon it's called, MC, ACL, H, HCL? No, that's hydrochloride. <laughs> M, I don't know, I don't know what I've done, but basically I've hyperextended my knee at a game of touch rugby, which is disappointing, but it's not the end of the world. I can still, I can still do this, I can still run, but I just can't lock my knee out. So as far as leg training, you know, as far as fucking hack squats and squats and, and leg press and things like that, um, I'm going to take it easy right now. I've, um, I've been icing my knee on and off the last two days. It's, it's gotten better. I haven't done a complete tear. It may be a, it may be a partial tear of a, of a ligament or a tendon in there. Um, I may go and get it checked out if I need to, but basically what I'm going to do is, I, I don't want surgery. I don't want to be told that I need surgery, so I'm just going to let it heal, let it, you know, do its thing not push it, not going to push it, I'm just going to let it do its thing, I'm going to let it heal. I just wanted to update you guys because a lot of you follow me through rugby and, you know, I'm sorry to disappoint, I tried, I really fucking did, but we're just going to have to take it a little bit slower and a little bit easier than before. My, my, my knees, my legs aren't used to stepping like they have been in the past, so with that said, I thought I'd just give you a quick update. I'm finally making a video holding a rugby ball. That's going to be, actually that's a fucking good thumbnail. I'm going to do that. You guys are going to like this thumbnail. Something like that. Anyways. Um, what else, what else, what else? I've got a baby. You guys know that. So right now, I'm actually going to go back downstairs and start playing with her. And leave you guys until the next time. So with that said, I'm injured. I can't train legs, but it's not the end of the world. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.